I believe that the fashion industry, or I don't believe it's a fact, is a uh, one of the biggest contributors to environmental stress. last position was creative director of the Champion brand. I think that I felt responsible for putting uh, so much clothing out in the world and I felt like I was leaving behind a lot of clothing. I think I was faced uh, with the thought of not being happy, not feeling very creative even though I had worked my way through the ranks. Most of my day was spent in meetings <laughs> and looking at projections and profit and loss uh, statements and, and less about really touching the product and being more hands-on and creative. I launched my own business uh, two years ago, um, my own brand, Simota Studio. After working in the fashion industry for well over 25 years, I have started to really realize I don't even want to buy any new raw materials because there is so much out there currently that can be repurposed and reutilized. I have been uh, making an effort uh, to utilize things that already existed and recut them, remaster them, um, repurpose them, reimagine them. Um, and, and it's a very hands on process, and uh, it's probably the most creative I've felt since I was in school. <laughs> Creativity happens in the process. I'm a true maker and I do things with my hands. I'm, I'm obsessed with detail and how things get put together and how um, they work. And I may not know what I'm doing, but I figure it out and I, I work with it. And I like to um, explore mistakes because I look at mistakes <laughs> as opportunities to do something better with it, make it beautiful. So you take something that's, you know, imperfect. My thought is to um, package myself as a consultant to work with these big brands to say, you have some defective product, you have something that didn't sell, give that to me. I'm gonna figure out how to remake that and we'll get it back out in the market. My name's Carla Mota and I'm a fashion designer.